How about some Cardinal Division action now? Springfield hosting Napoleon. The Blue Devils get to work fast. Maya Woodley drives baseline. Her shot won't go, but Tessa Troutman has her back as Springfield started on a 10-0 run. That lead would grow to 20 as Aaliyah Hodges dishes to Kaylee Taylor. She drains the triple, pushing her to 11 points in the first half alone. Napoleon then finally in double digits when Michaela Cruz nails a shot from downtown, but the deficit just too great. Taylor steals the ball. She's going the other way. Can't connect, though, on the fast break, but she does grab her own board, so pass. Pass and bang from Hodges. Springfield, big winners tonight, 42-18, behind 15 points from Taylor. I think we pushed really, really hard the first two halves, which is what we struggled with throughout the season. Um, but we got our stuff together. We've been working on it at practice, and we managed to pull through the rest of the game. I think it's a good challenge for us to like push ourselves to lead our own team, and I think we can go far. With more, it's Brandon Lowe and Jim Strahl. Thursday night hoops, Jim, always a fun time. Oh, and yes. tonight between Springfield and Napoleon was no different. But it was Springfield that came out. They were on the gas right away. Yeah. A big first half from then was really the tone setter throughout this game. Yeah, you're right. It sure was that first quarter. Napoleon couldn't get off the snod. And Springfield just put it to them and, just, and then just kept the pressure up the whole way. And, led on to a 20-point 20 vi victory. And then the second half. I mean, it was a different story in the second half. You could tell Napoleon made the changes at both the offensive and defensive end. They stepped up. They came to play. But it was really too late after that big first half from Springfield. Yeah, you're exactly right. They dug themselves too deep of a hole to, to get out of. The, I think the closest they got was like 15 or 16 in the second half. The two seniors for Springfield step up in a big way tonight. Yeah. Kalea Taylor, Aliyah Hodges both had fantastic games. And if they can get those performances out of those two moving forward, this is a Springfield team that could go on to make some noise. Yeah, they could. They're going to sneak up, I think, on someone when tournament comes around because somebody told me, which I didn't even know, that this was only their third win of the year. And they looked pretty good for only the third win of the year. I thought that was that's hard to believe for me. So. Springfield, they get the job done tonight. That'll do it for us here.